Hey everybody, welcome back to Turnovision. It's the last night of the second rehearsals. That's a mouthful, but this time we have the big, big five, five as opposed to the smaller <laughs> 35 that we've already been through. Let's take a look at these clips. First is France, and they are my favorite. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what we got. Let's... It looks like pure chaos on that stage. I love it. <laughs> it's really cool. Lots of fire. <laughs> okay, it's mm. very similar to what we seen on their nationals. Yeah. They just tried to make it even more mystical. That it is. I love that France isn't playing it safe this year at no. all. At all. It's awesome. <laughs> That stage is alive. I mean, there was just so much going on. It just looked like mm -hmm. looked like a, a fire <laughs> was breaking out behind them all the time. Yeah. Yeah. It Did it crazy. feel like she was dancing with a devil? Ooh, I don't know about <laughs> that. <laughs> then again, I'm not the world's foremost expert on devil dancing. I've done a little bit, maybe an amateur devil dancer, but not <laughs> enough <For> to... <laughs> which glass over. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, uh, so far everything looks good, very yeah. similar to what they had on Nationals, mm -hmm. and I love that song, I hope they will do well, Yeah, I will end up very high. So. Yeah, well, I've got a high impression of them, for certain. <laughs> Alright, what's next? Good job, friends. The next one is the Mighty Italy. Ooh, the hometown crowd, mm -hmm. huh? With two superstars, Mahmoud and Blanca. Do you think they can win two years in a row? Oh, they can do anything, it's Italy. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Let's check out what we've got. Oh wow, they're really not shy with lights. Yeah, yeah, spared no expense with the lighting, that's for certain. Yeah. I think they they used all the lights for their hometown <laughs> heroes there. <laughs> they brought in a few extras too. Yeah, I didn't expect that I would say that because I thought those guys are just spotless with their vocals, but this was not their the strongest performance. I don't know, maybe they're tired, maybe it's just... Uh, I don't yeah. know, bad sound, but... Long flight. Yeah. Uh, you any know, from other... Italy to Italy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. What do you think? Because yeah. I've seen several of these performances, and each time they just were nailing it with vocals. Well, I think it's a very powerful performance, and it's hard for me to say anything negative about it. Yeah, it really I don't is. want to say anything negative. But I, yeah. I do agree, it may not have been their best vocal performance. Let's see uh, Let's see if they really pull out all the stops and, and do it perfectly. Yeah, it's their home. Show. They should have perfect yeah. <laughs> sound and everything yeah, exactly. here, you know? Mm -hmm. Fix for your own guys. <laughs> you know, like, what is going on? <laughs> Maybe the lights distracted them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, next one is UK. Ooh. Oh, wow. It's very interesting staging. He killed it during that London performance. Oh, at the he Hard did. Rock. I think he was probably the star of the show. I mean, it was his, it was his home grounds. You mm -hmm. know, his, but I think... Uh, it's tough to deny that this guy just is a superstar. I mean, he really is. It looks like he's in a light cage. Yeah. A cage of light. That's crazy cool stage and I like it. Yeah. He had very interesting outfit. Mm -hmm. And again, he sings perfectly. I'm sensing he may get at least one vote this year. <laughs> okay, how does it feel to be not on the bottom, but it was actual shot for a win? Yeah. Crazy. Good job this year, Good job. awesome. All right, so we have now Spain. Oh, the strobe lights are pretty cool. There wasn't a whole lot else going on with that set, though. Not a lot to look she at. She's a diva, but yeah. I need to say, when we reacted first time, I was really critical about her look. Mm -hmm. It kind of made her look like uh, worse than she was. Yeah. And here they fixed everything. Her outfit is probably my favorite of this year. First of all, you can feel there a little bit of ethnical Spanish elements, yeah. but at the same time, it's very trendy, very modern, very yeah. sexy. Yep. Just absolutely amazing. I just kept she, thinking bullfighter. I don't know what, <laughs> but she looks like a true star. It's amazing. Yeah. Good job fixing it and mm. staying in the same concept, but making it 10 times better. Nice, nice. Yeah, she can dance. She can sing, she can perform, she is beautiful, and she doesn't need any other stage. And it's all about her and her ability to dance and sing at the same time. You think and she's going to draw a lot of votes this year? The thing is that in this category, with a very beautiful, sexy lady, sing something, dance it, she's that one. There's yep. no competition at all. So if you're into such, who else? Well, Cypress puts it together, you know. Because... Cypress in a more folk, ethnical way. Yeah, maybe. This is straight going for the man hearts. Yeah, I guess you're right. So she's alone there, and whoever in this kind of music, they will vote for her. She may have like huge number of public vote. 
Yeah. So, okay. We'll see. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. Ooh, next is Germany. The set is really cool. All the instruments mm-hmm. around him and him kind of walking around playing it. The way they have that set up is, it really speaks to me. I really enjoyed that. It looks like, a, you know, an old uh, story kind of studio, a recording studio, where there's just a lot of classic instruments that have been played on a lot of great records <laughs> all around. I mean, there's something really cool with that vibe. It looks to me like a man cave, mm-hmm. you know, like a secret room that every man wants to have with all his favorite toys. And when he feels <laughs> down, he just goes to that room yep. to play his favorite toys. Do a little bit of rapping. Yeah. A little bit of emotional rapping and musicians. Yeah, I mean, yeah. <laughs> Definitely, it's so different from any other uh, staging we've seen this year, right? Yeah. Everybody tries to use a lot of lights, some yep. crazy explosions, fire, and they went to this very cozy, almost lonely feel. Like, almost feels like nobody in that room except him. Yeah. And he's just kind of walking around, pondering and creating. And, yeah, it's neat. I like it. I like it. I like it a lot more than I like the song, I have to confess. Yes, yes. Staging way into the yeah. whole thing. What can I say? People usually complain about Big Five and how they don't deserve to go to finals without going through mm-hmm. competition like the rest. This year, all five of them deserve to be in finals. Yeah. It's really strong performances and they were not lazy this year. I agree. Really, yeah. thank you for 100%. doing this. Yeah. It's cool. Good deal. All right. Well, that wraps up the second rehearsals. Eurovision, the performances, the live performances are right around the corner. What do you think, now that we've seen everybody in action, who are your favorites? Let us know. So, we're going to be telling you who our favorites are in an upcoming video, so be on the lookout for that. As always, make sure to like and subscribe. We'll see you next time on Turn On Vision.